what's going on everybody the silent gamer and i'm back with the video if you haven't checked out my last video the link is down in the description but today we're going to talk about madden nfl 18 and what you see on the screen here now if you haven't seen the trailer it's all over the internet right now you will see where the frostbite engine is implemented in madden 18 they're possibly going to have a story mode it looks fantastic it looks really good uh, but this what you see on the screen is what I am intrigued by you see the three levels of game styles You see the arcade simulation and the competitive mode um, The arcade mode as you see over the top action field with spectacular plays lots of scoring and limited penalties The simulation mode is true to the player team ratings with authentic NFL rules and gameplay and competitive mode where user stick skills are king and our head-to-head -head online uh, ranked online and tournament default so these three modes are great because for me it seems like everything could be spaced out for all gamers like for me i always thought that madden was driven by mutt well madden ultimate team and no matter what mode you played on it revolved around madden ultimate team but now it looks like they've been able to you know divide all three modes into where you know the arcade guys can play the way they want to play the competitive guys can play the way they want to play and the simulation guys can play the way we want to play and this is you know borderline exciting for me because I can't get too hyped because we haven't seen the game in motion yet I haven't played it yet so I just want to pass on my quick thoughts this is what's needed no joke simulation gamers guys who want to play on you know regular CFM type games they they need that this is what we want we've seen too many times in Madden where the arcade mode or the competitive mode has always been where it's at and we've been overlooked so when you ever have any tuners and any other patches you know they can spread out to those guys to where those guys can really you know get what they want the simulation guys we just want core gameplay and we want the players that we choose or the team that we choose to play on the field play like their counterparts and the only thing that we want to be able to do is adjust the game plans and run the plays <clears throat> excuse me I'm sorry um, run the plays accordingly and let the best players win now yes there's going to be some skill there's going to be some thinking behind it when we do run our plays you don't want to run the wrong play no matter what kind of personnel you got you run the wrong play you're just going to get you know get handled for it it is what it is but at the same time you want your players to play like how they're designed in real life i mean it looks good it i mean it the game in my opinion it looks too good for it not to play that way the players look too nice for it to play like that the player movement is still shaky or whatever from what we've seen in 17 we haven't seen enough in 18 but from based on the way that the quality of the visuals of that game it should not play all crazy like unless you play on these other modes so it's just my quick thoughts about it I, i'm really hoping that they deliver on this because i'm quite honest i'm having a blast with 17 i enjoyed it you know i enjoyed 16 for what it was and maybe now i can take it to the next level where i don't have to play, worry about playing another year of my cfm on madden 17 i can jump on to the next game and don't have to worry about you know an older title like i am doing right now with nba live 15 i'm still playing that game so i hope you guys enjoyed the video let me know your feedback let me know what you guys think about all of this i love the game style differentiations and i hope you guys enjoy take care